So signing on to 2020, it's very exciting for you? Yeah, super exciting. Um, yeah, just the group of girls that we've got, it made my decision really easy. Like, I love training and playing with them every day. Um, then the coaching staff we have as well, they're just awesome. And um, we've got some new fresh faces that have really um, added a bit of spark to our training sessions and lifted up, yeah, like the mood and everything's really positive this season. So I'm excited. And recently you've just um, had a trip away. Tell us um, what that trip was and, and what kind of community and village you were around. Uh, yeah, so I went to Lao with um, Pass It Back and it's um, funded by Australian Aid and a few others and um, Pass It Back's also come on board as a charity sponsor for the next Rugby World Cup. So um, yeah, it was an awesome opportunity for me. I think I got um, almost more out of it than some of the kids did, but it was just great. Like the communities that we went to were really rural. Um, and just seeing the kids have the opportunity to run around with a footy and like their ball skills and stuff were amazing. Um, yeah, they don't have the chance to play like we do here, but just the way they pick up things was yeah really cool to see. You do so many camps, I mean, throughout Australia as well, but to have that impact overseas, it's international sport as well. Does that just did it mean a little bit more going over there and seeing their faces and, and teaching them new skills? Yeah, and I think for like those kids don't have the opportunity that some of our kids in Australia do, so just being able to um, do really simple things with them made such a huge impact and um, I remember Lewis doing push-ups in front of them and they thought it was like the most hilarious thing they've ever seen and they just had so much fun and the like pure joy they got out of playing rugby um, really made me appreciate my situation back home but um, yeah it's just I think all kids should have the right to play sport and um, just engage in activities with their friends and you learn so much through sport. Do you have any more involvement coming up with uh, similar situations like that? Yeah I'm hoping to. I kind of want to make sure that for everything I do overseas I want to also do um, the equal amount back here so um, I'd love to get into some of the rural communities around Australia and give back a little bit there but yeah hopefully do some more through Southeast Asia, Asia and um, I know Pass It also just gone into Fiji so um, yeah it's exciting times ahead and hopefully I can keep working alongside them. And hopefully in the future see some rugby stars no doubt with the skills you taught them <laughs> there'll be some more girls running around with a rugby ball soon. Yeah I think so their under 18s team has a tournament coming up soon so um, yeah they're looking to hopefully win a few games and um, I think they just love the opportunity that they get to even travel around Asia and compete with their friends so um, it just seems universal that people just love playing sport with their friends and yeah I'm stoked they get the opportunity to do so.